Hi guys, welcome to my channel Way She Blushes. In today's video, I will be comparing rose hip seed oil with rose hip helichrysum oil based on my personal experience of using them both. Before that, I would like to take a tiny moment and ask you guys to subscribe to my channel. You can also go through some of my latest videos which have been about product comparisons and foundation swatches and reviews kind of videos. And if you do like my content, then consider subscribing. Now coming back to the products of today's video, both of these facial oils are from the brand Juicy Chemistry. So this is the first oil, this is Rose Hip Seed Oil. The other oil is Helichrysum Rose Hip Oil. I have used Rose Hip Seed Oil for more than a year and I have used Rose Hip Helichrysum Oil for over 6 months now. I have used these facial oils both during summers and winters. I have a combination skin which turns dry during winters. First I will be taking you through both of these products individually and then I will be comparing it based on my experience. Rose Hip Seed Oil is rich in antioxidants. It also has vitamin A which heals your skin from sun damage, it also reduces wrinkles and hyperpigmentation and it also treats acne. Helichrysum and rose hip facial oil has all the goodness of rose hip plus it also has oil of helichrysum. Helichrysum oil promotes skin healing and it treats skin infections and inflammations. Now you must be thinking helichrysum rose hip oil must be better than rose hip seed oil. Now is it true? I will tell you all about that in today's video so let's get started. Now the first point of comparison would be skin type both of these facial oils are suited for which skin type now I have used rose hip seed oil for my combination skin and I have used it both during summers and winters and it has suited me really really well now, if you have oily skin you can use rose hip seed oil because this oil treats acne and acne scars and uh, I think it will be very good for oily skin because oily skin is prone to acne I'm addressing this because in my last video where I compared rose hip seed oil with kakadu plum pomegranate facial oil us video mein i got a lot of questions uh, from people with oily skin ki wo isko use kar sakte hain ki nahi if rose hip seed oil is good for oily skin or not that is why i felt like addressing it that it is perfectly good for oily skin and also if you want to see that video where i compared kakadu plum with rose hip seed oil i will link that video right here for you to watch and also in the description box this oil is good for oily and combination skin both and I can vouch for this like I can say this from my personal experience whenever I would see a pimple about to pop up on my face and I would apply this uh, during the night I always applied both rose hip and helichrysum rose hip in my nighttime skincare routine and whenever I would apply this at night next morning the pimple would be it would be suppressed and it would it would almost vanish and if the pimple was small pimple ke liye, acne ke liye, I have personally seen it working on my skin that is why I'm so sure about recommending it Helichrysum rose hip oil on the other hand has never ever worked on my acne I'm not sure why is it because this oil does have rose hip in it but still it never worked on my acne and that's just it apart from acne rose hip seed oil also works on pigmentation it evens out the skin tone I can vouch for this from my own experience I mean rose hip seed oil works and it is wonderful and same goes for helichrysum rose hip oil it works on pigmentation it does evens out your skin tone just like rose hip oil so i will be giving equal points to both for this one thing that i have to mention in today's video is this helichrysum facial oil helichrysum rose hip facial oil also works on tanned skin i mean i still remember when i was in goa of course i was tanned and it really helped me heal my skin from sun damage and of course tanning maybe isne mujhe bahut help kiya tha helichrysum rose hip oil ko main goa mein bhi use kar rahi thi in my night time skin care routine aur us time par bhi isne meri skin ka kafi khayal rakha i mean my skin was burned during the day or raat ko it kept my skin really calm and radiant so definitely that really you know helped my skin aur goa se wapas aane ke baad bhi i felt that my 
tan wore off very quickly with this oil. Now coming back to rosehip seed oil, अब इसके बारे में भी कुछ अच्छी बातें बता देते हैं. I use this oil on my hair as well. I use it mostly when my scalp is really itchy because of dandruff and because it has anti-inflammatory properties. ये मुझको मेरे scalp पे itchiness से और dandruff में भी काफी help करता है. Also I feel this oil is not only good for dandruff but it is also good for dry and damaged hair. One more comparison point would be which facial oil moisturizes my skin better. I have used both of these facial oil only in my nighttime skincare routine and I can say that both of these facial oil works equally good as moisturizers. मुझको ऐसा नहीं लगा कि कोई ज़्यादा अच्छे से moisturize कर रहा है, कोई कम कर रहा है. I think दोनों ही equally good moisturizers हैं. Just that the density of rosehip seed oil is thicker than helichrysum rosehip oil. I will demonstrate and I will show you the consistency. Of both of these facial oil now. Now this is rosehip seed oil. I will be taking some oil on my hand. This is the oil. Its color thoda sa yellowish sa hai, and I am just massaging it on my hand now. ये थोड़ा सा इसका density thick है helichrysum से और ये absorb होने में भी थोड़ा सा time लगाता है. इसको जब मैं रात को भी यूज करती थी तो मुझको अपने बेड टाइम से कम से कम इसको एक घंटा या 45 मिनट्स पहले लगाना पड़ता था क्योंकि ये थोड़ा सा थोड़ी देर तक लगाने के बाद फेस के ऊपर थोड़ा स्टिकी रहता है एंड नाउ इट्स हेलिक्राइजम रोज हिप ऑयल टर्न पोरिंग इट ऑन माई हैंड एंड दिस इज द ऑयल ये बहुत तेजी से नीचे जा रहा है क्योंकि इसका कंसिस्टेंसी थोड़ा सा लाइटर साइड पे है एंड नाउ आई एम मसाजिंग इट ये बहुत जल्दी एब्जॉर्ब हो जाता है स्किन में इसको लगाने के बाद फेस के ऊपर कुछ भी ऐसा स्टिकी नहीं लगता है एक और चीज जो मुझे बता देनी चाहिए अबाउट द फ्रेगरेंस रोजिप सीड ऑयल का फ्रेगरेंस थोड़ा सा मस्टर्ड ऑयल की जैसा है बट अ लिटल लेस पंजेंट बट सिमिलर टू दैट इसका फ्रेगरेंस उतना अच्छा नहीं है बट हेलीक्राइजम रोजिप सीड ऑयल का फ्रेगरेंस अच्छा है एज कम्पेयर टू रोजिप ऑयल आई फील द फ्रेगरेंस ऑफ अ प्रोडक्ट ऑल्सो अफेक्ट योर एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ यूजिंग इट सो आई थॉट आई शुड हाईलाइट दैट की फ्रेगरेंस का भी आपको पता होना चाहिए दिस वॉज माई ओपिनियन ऑन बोथ ऑफ दीज फेशियल ऑयल्स आई पर्सनली लव बोथ ऑफ दीज आई हैव हैड पॉजिटिव रिजल्ट from using both of these facial oils अब आपको decide करना है based on your skin and your needs कि आपको कौन सा facial oil सही रहेगा so that was it for today's video I really hope that you found this video informative and useful if you have any questions regarding the products in today's video use the comment section and ask me also don't forget to give this video a like and also consider subscribing to my YouTube channel where she blushes so thank you so much for watching today's video I will see you in a new video on my channel very soon till then take care of yourself bye bye